Did you know that temperatures are now colder than during most of the last 10,000 years? I bet you won't see that on the news. Or that carbon dioxide concentrations have been flirting with disastrously low levels for millions of years. It's time to get the facts. Gregory Wrightstone's new book reveals the greatest untold story of modern times. That a warmer climate and more carbon dioxide are leading to a flourishing of humanity, an abundance of food and longer lives. From the top of glaciers to the depths of the oceans, this fascinating journey weaves millions of years of geologic and atmospheric records together that delivers irrefutable evidence that you have been misled by the climate industrial complex. That has led to wildfires. That is why we've seen the wildfires in Greece that I've mentioned. Wild and dramatic fluctuations in our planet's past confirms that our concerns over a modest amount of warming are foolish. Wrightstone's examination of the climate facts reveals that we are experiencing declines in heat waves, droughts, wildfires and extreme events. And all the while, the ecosystems and the human condition are flourishing. Why fossil fuels are really just a giant solar energy battery? Why future historians will marvel at the mass delusion over a relatively scarce but beneficial molecule? Glean a deeper understanding of the climate than ever before in a holistic account of how the complex relationship between the sun, earth, oceans and time work together to determine the climate we experience every day. Gregory Wrightstone's A Very Convenient Warming How a Modest Warming and More CO2 Are Benefiting Humanity will provide you with the tools to persuade your friends and family that there is no need for anxiety over our climate and that the foolish pursuit of net carbon zero will drastically reduce food production, control nearly every aspect of your lives and lead to economic destruction. Get Gregory Wrightstone's latest book, A Very Convenient Warming, How a Modest Warming and More CO2 Are Benefiting Humanity.